Just going to have a look at, that's a beautiful World War II American Crusher, original, 100% original. There's a Crusher uh, that goes with a uniform, a complete World War II United States Air Force uh, uniform. World War II. Um, Cornwall Light Infantry, I think that is. A Brady helmet. <clears throat> Irish Guards. And down falls the belt. 16th century Italian officer's helmet. French Shaco, 1830s or Waterloo period. For two French fire helmets. Canadian mounted infantry. Sl sling that belt over my shoulder. Moving along. Original United States World War II senior officer's visor cap, gold plated insignia. There's a naval officer, naval pilot officer. World War II American. Um, I have the chin, it goes with that, and the, the awards. He was a fighter pilot at Midway. Here we have another French helmet. Notice the, uh, what do you call that? The, it's almost like brush. It's, it's possibly hostile. Scottish side cap, garrison cap. Another French helmet with a impact there. A beautiful, First Lancers what is it? helmet around the 1850s. Dutch Guards, a few German helmets down the bottom there. WSS coming up top here. Vintage tie officer cap, 18, uh, 1930s CM um, headpiece there. Very similar to the German, all one style. Uh, British pith helmet, Thai police, vintage, colonel, senior naval officer, commander, vintage, um, royal guards, Thai, Thai royal guards, and Thai paratrooper. What have we got there? Thai army officer, Thai cavalry guard, a couple of high wards. Tire Wars. Uh, we've got a Prussian helmet down there, a Siamese Japanese helmet, and a uh, Thai 1970s Vietnam War visor cap. Got all these swords, etc., as well. So that's a look at some of the headgear.